Hey, what's going on you guys? My name is Dividable Halo and today I'm bringing you guys a commentary on what's going on with my channel. So today as you guys could read in the topic or the title of this video, I'm going to be talking about my future interview plans, the future of my channel, and what other stuff I'm going to be uploading considering I'm at a hundred and some almost 50 subscribers. So yeah, that's almost pretty good considering my channel's been up for almost like... I started the interview series like a month ago and I've cr increased dr drastically. Yeah, so today in this video I'm going to be talking about the future of my channel and I'm going to be telling you guys first off on the first topic is who I'm going to be interviewing next. Now many people have been asking me all over Facebook saying who am I going to interview next and I've really not considered it. I've just kind of had like the moment to interview some people and I was like okay let's interview you and I know you and let's see if I can. So basically today I was thinking and I decided who am I going to interview and I'm going to tell you what I'm going to interview next. Now if you guys don't know who this guy is, his name is Master Leglink. You probably know him as Kurt from Highcom, the sparring dude. So yes, I'm going to be interviewing him. Some of you guys may think it's a dumb thing to do considering a lot of you guys do not like Kurt or whatever. But yeah, he's part of the community and he's one aspect of the current community. And he was also involved in some intelligence stuff back then. Next person I'm also going to be interviewing is the one and only Mr. General JB or J General JB172, who is the brother of Shadow Sniper172. The guy who basically I interviewed uh, last time, which is Shadow. And yeah, he the, was the last leader of the United Nations, and everybody probably knows him from his YouTube channel, Mr. General JB, and all the United Nations recruitment videos. So it's going to be pretty interesting to uh, talk about him and the past of the UN and much more. Alright, the next person I'm also going to be interviewing is going to probably be iSlayer UK. I messaged him on Facebook and he said, yeah, he's down for an interview and we're probably going to be doing that. Now, other than that, all these other people that I'm going to be interviewing, I'm not really sure who yet I'm going to be interviewing. I know I'm trying to interview people, some more of the UNSC community, such as like Malcolm from uh, Navcom, who I believe he was the founder of Navcom. Right now, I currently believe Navcom is a democracy. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah, I'm going to be interviewing um, Malcolm, and I'm also going to be interviewing someone from Navspec War. Now, the current, I believe there's a different leader of Navspec War than the founder. There's two guys. I'm going to be talking to both of them, hopefully. It really depends on if I could get in contact with them. I have a guy who's going to hook me up with him later, and it would be pretty amazing. Other than that, all of the other iconic figures, I'm not really sure I'll be interviewing that much other people unless I find them important to the community. And if you guys were thinking like about the last interview, because I know a lot of you guys said, like, who the heck's Panther and all that. Well, he was pretty important in the old community, and he's still important to this community right now. Or maybe not as important as he was back then. But either way, he was pretty important, and I thought he was, he was uh, someone that deserved to be interviewed. And he revealed a lot of information that not much people knew in the community. Alright, so those are basically the people I'm going to be interviewing in the next series. Uh, there probably will be more. Uh, there's, yeah, there will be more for sure after that. And one thing I'm going to also talk about next is a machinima that's going to be coming up that's not going to be right away. It might be in a couple months or so. Maybe in a long time, but I'm not really sure what I'm going to be doing. All I know is I have a machinima in my head and I'm going to start writing it up pretty soon. And the machinima is basically going to be called like the Halo Clan Community Machinima. Basically, it's going to be something more or less like a news reel or something like that. I'm not really sure. It's going to be like a, it's going to be like a machinima that talks about the future, past, and it's going to, or the future and the past, and the majority of it's going to be about the past with like all these big clans such as like the United Nations, the Department of Defense, and many more clans. So even people that don't, uh, that aren't in the Halo Clan community, will be able to watch this awesome machinima and will probably enjoy it. And that will probably attract more people to the Halo Clan community. Now, in the last commentary that I did with, uh, what is it, the next-gen clans, not much people liked the way I talked in it, and that was because I was talking way too fast, messing my grammar up and everything like that, which is reasonable since I'm talking really fast this one, but either way, I'm that's just the way I am, and I do improve... I, I do basically improve my videos or I improve my commentaries the more I like commentate and everything like that. So that's what I'm going to be doing or that's what I have to say to you guys about that. 
now going back to the machinima thing i'm going to be also uh, recruiting some directors for it more or less an editor i know i have a guy called literally dave if you guys don't know him he was part of the arc i'm not really sure what his name was but he was the zypher hd and all that but now he's literally dave and he said that he'd help me with this machinima and well this was just a thing that we just talked about randomly and yeah that brings us to the next topic which is halo clan followers now if you guys don't know what halo clan followers is yet it's basically a group of uh... directors where we're gonna where, where we're gonna be basically updating you guys on news uh... anything that's commentaries on the new channel it's gonna be linked down in the description below be sure to go subscribe to that channel right away also like the facebook page halo clan followers currently we have three directors the directors are me dividable halo there is saint makoto from the legans or yeah, Legan's a sin, and there's also Dave, literally Dave, the one that I was talking about earlier. Yeah, so we're all these guys are basically really well at editing videos, including me. I know how to edit videos now. Don't make fun of me saying that or saying that I'm using Movie Maker right now, but honestly, this channel is just a small channel. It's not a professional channel yet. I do know how to use stuff like Sony Vegas and stuff like that. It's just that I didn't. Re I don't really have the time to edit with all that, considering I have a job and. It's been really busy throughout the holidays, and considering my diplomas are coming up for my school and everything like that. So that's what I'm going to be doing for that. For that, And not sure what I have to talk about. I know I have another topic I want to talk about. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, so my last topic that I'm going to be talking about is recently I just joined an eSport game. Or not eSport game, <laughs> an eSport team. And that team is called Team Core. Team Core GG on Twitter. So I joined Team Core and I became known as Core Dividable. Now, what does that mean for me? That basically means that I'm going to be doing a lot of live streams or a couple live streams when I get my Xbox One and set up and everything. And I'm going to be doing some live streams on Twitch and maybe even YouTube that's going to be like relating to some random games because all I did was apply or got the job as a um, live streamer. And it wasn't that big, but it was still something good. And Team Core, it's basically. It's a new rebranded re -branded, uh, team off of, uh, what is it, Tyrant? Tyrant Gaming. And I knew the guy personally, and he's like, hey, I know you know how to record videos. Maybe you could live stream. I'm like, yeah, sure. And maybe even later I'll be uh, uploading some uh, eSport games, commentaries, and much more. So, anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I kind of covered what I'm going to be doing later on with my channel. Be sure to subscribe, comment, and like if you guys enjoy my content already. I know I have a lot of people that are disliking my content right now, but that's probably because there's a lot of clans and a lot of opinions being thrown around within the Halo clan community. Anyways, guys, that is it. Once again, comment down in the description below what you guys want to see from the future of my channel. Bye.